Hi everyone, how are you? It's Andre here, Licensed Immigration Advisor. In this video, I'm going to talk about the new green list for New Zealand immigration, which has just been announced today. Um, there's been quite a lot of updates today. I'm doing a separate video for each update. This video is just about the new green list. So what is the green list? Well, it's a new list from immigration, which specifies um, like high skilled jobs in demand or just jobs that uh, New Zealand really needs. Um, now you'll see there's two different sections on this list. There's um, a section for fast-tracked residents and a section for residents after two years. So what's been indicated today is if you're on this fast-tracked residence list, um, you can come to New Zealand obviously on a work visa from 4th of July 2022 and you can actually apply for residence from September 2022. So if you're on this list and if you meet the um, wage requirements and the qualification requirements. Um, you can actually apply from September 2022, but um, the government has also indicated that if you're offshore, there might be a direct pathway to apply if you're offshore from September 2022. I don't know exactly what that means, if that means the skilled migrant category is opening or if they're offering some other pathway. It's all a little bit vague um, and the announcements just came through today, so I don't know exactly what they mean, but they've indicated that there might also be a direct pathway from offshore as well. Now the jobs in the section, I'm going to put the list up here so you can have a look. It's mostly for engineering jobs, construction jobs, medical jobs and some IT jobs. Now that's for the fast-tracked residents. There's also the residents after two years and that's for some more uh, medical jobs, some trades and also um, some farming jobs as well. So I'm going to put that list up as well. So you should be able to see the first list was the fast track residents and the second list I've just put up now, um, that's for residents after two years. That's like a new work to residence program. You come to New Zealand on a work visa, you work for two years and then you can apply for residence. Um, it's all a little bit vague and confusing now. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna be posting more updates as I get more information. But it's worth having a look, seeing if your job's on the um, green list. If you're under that fast track category, um, that means it might be worth trying to get a work visa to New Zealand as soon as possible or a student visa to New Zealand as soon as possible because as soon as you can get in and get it like a suitable job you might be able to apply for residence straight away. Anyway, I'll be posting more updates soon. If this short video was helpful please like, please share, please subscribe and I'll see you all later.